I'm Gareth O'Davis from the Daily Telegraph in London. I'm here in Las Vegas for the WBO welterweight title between Jesse Vargas defending against Manny Pacquiao. They're calling this the champ against the legend, but really Manny Pacquiao increased his legendary status with his last time out against Timothy Bradley and I thought looked fantastic. I think we can see the same boxing skills from him this time. Um, there's an energy that he's brought to his boxing and his politics at the same time. I think it's in some ways rejuvenated him. He's got to be wary of Vargas. He's a hungry young lion who wants to be the king of the jungle in the welterweight division. Um, I expect a close fight early on in the contest and then Manny Pacquiao to take away um, the skills that Vargas has with his tenacity and aggressiveness in the middle rounds. And it wouldn't surprise me if Manny won by uh, a powerful points decision by the end of 12 rounds or even forced a late stoppage. Hey, this is Chris Robinson here with HustleBoss.com just talking Manny Pacquiao, Jesse Vargas. You know, I know Jesse's a big underdog, 7-1, but sometimes in boxing, you can't really use your logic. Um, if I had to break the fight down, Manny still looks good, still looks fresh, still dangerous. I could see why he's a favorite, but uh, being around Jesse for years out here in Vegas, and just, I kind of, he rubs off on you. The belief he has in himself carries over, and I feel something in the air. Um, I'm not certain about it, but I'm just going to go with the Hail Mary. I feel Team Vargas has the recipe for an upset this weekend, so it wouldn't shock me. I'm just going for the upset this weekend. By how? Uh, I'm going to go... I think Jesse will uh, win a decision and hurt Pacquiao along the way, but uh, Pacquiao's a strong champion. He'll, it'll go the distance. I'm Lance Pugmire with the Los Angeles Times, and my prediction for the Jesse Vargas Manny Pacquiao fight is Manny Pacquiao to record his first knockout victory since 2009. I think that Jesse Vargas is going to try to come at Manny pretty hard early in this fight, and I can see Manny stopping him by the fifth round. Hello, uh, I am Salvador Rodriguez from ESPN Deportes. Uh, my prediction for Pacquiao Vargas is that uh, he's going to tough fight for Vargas. The champion has uh, a lot of proof to prove with Manny. Manny is, the, is one of the best of his uh, era. Uh, I believe that he has the advantage. Uh, I won't say that it's a 50-55, but I say that it's a 70-30 for Pacquiao. So I see winning Manny Pacquiao on Saturday night by unanimous decision. I'm Ryan Sangalia of Rappler.com in The Ring Magazine. And my prediction for the fight between Manny Pacquiao and Jesse Vargas is I believe that Manny Pacquiao will win the fight. Whether by knockout or decision remains to be seen. Uh, I think Pacquiao has the opponent in front of him who would be best suited for Manny to knock out. Uh, Vargas is a taller guy that means a lot of target. Uh, he's an offensive fighter. He's an attacker. Uh, Pacquiao still has power. It remains to be seen whether or not he still has the uh, desire to follow up and finish a guy. He dropped Timothy Bradley uh, last fight twice so uh, the power is still there. Uh, but uh, if for the money, I, I would go by Pacquiao by decision. Well, I'll tell you, uh, it's going to be a great fight Saturday night with Jesse Vargas and Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao, definitely a, a Hall of Famer for sure. And uh, eight-time uh, different division champion. Says a lot about his uh, talent as a fighter, loved by everybody. He's 37 years old, and he's been in some tough fights throughout his years. And, and in boxing, you know, sometimes uh, you hate to see a great fighter, you know, stay there thumb a little too long. It's, and I, but I, you know, but in his last fight when he beat Timothy Bradley, he showed he still has a little spark of the old flash. And uh, Jesse Vargas is going to be in for a difficult fight that night. Uh, but in boxing, anything is possible, and uh, I think it's going to be a great fight. I think Pacquiao is going to have his hands full, but I think in the long run he may end up pulling it out. A lot of people are underestimating uh, Jesse Vargas. Do you think he has the? Do you think people are counting him out without seeing that he brings a lot to the table? You know, J Jesse Vargas is a young, 27-year-old fighter, two-time world champion, and uh, he has great talent. He has a great reach advantage over Manny Pacquiao. He has a uh, Dewey Cooper is his new trainer, and he's improved so much with, with Cooper. And he's going to be doing a lot of great boxing from the outside, you know, with good uh, left hooks and good straight right hands, uppercuts. They're going to be his key punches for the night, but. Uh, uh, he can surprise the world too because Jesse Vargas is a very talented fighter. So he, anything can happen. Joe, you're, you're pretty accurate when it comes to your predictions. What's your prediction for this fight? I, I, you know, this could be a fight that it could be very, very, 
difficult for both fighters. Uh, I, I can I can see it going either way, but a very close decision. I, I'm I'm going to lean a little bit towards uh, Pacquiao uh, as of right now. But come fight time, I may be changing with my way of thinking because you know these fighters sometimes they they they, they really uh, talk a good. Uh, a good game, and sometimes at the end I, I, I go the other way. But this fight is a toss of fight for me, as far as I'm concerned. It's going to be very, very difficult for both fighters, or maybe back out by a split decision, maybe.